company. I don't know how much background you know about it. But um, Ryan and Coley Brady are the two brothers who co-founded it. Their um, husband, their husband, their father um, started Heartland RV, which eventually sold out to Thor. Right. Plant. And then on behind it is Avenue. And we just broke ground behind that for our travel trailer line that we just started in Bower. I saw them. Yeah. yeah. I saw some of them. Yeah, there's a lot of
Oh, uh, wall would go. You probably know that there's two layers of Asdel. We don't use Luon on the inner wall like some manufacturers do. Um, Luon is a wood-based material. You think of a piece of cardboard and one drop of water gets on, it's gonna spread and eventually lead to delamination. So we pay the extra to get Asdel on both the outer and inner. So then that inside is gonna be aluminum and then it's gonna have block foam insulation throughout it because we feel like it doesn't break down as quickly as spray foam or the batten fiber insulation. So this will hold up a lot better in the long run. <laughs> we do route out the slide outs, but we don't take them completely out until they get over here. Once they get over here, they route them out the rest of the way, mark them with a VIN number, a model number, and it moves with the unit down the way. Some other manufacturers actually will have a hole and measure it each time, but there's always going to be some degree of human error, so it just makes sense to us to have it as part of it. I like this. This is pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, 340, 340. Yeah. yeah that's we do them in runs, and actually we can go up and you can kind of get a bird's eye view if you like. Ryan and Coley decided they wanted to really encourage their workers to have more family time at the end of the day. So we start at 6. They still get out of here at like 2, 3 o'clock. So it's wow. not late. Yeah. <clears throat> well, this is pretty neat. Yeah, you can, boy, you really Yeah. Can you see the process? They start from that. Yeah, yeah. they just work. Did they roll them on the rollers down? So, yeah, they um, will actually lift these bridges. They'll blow a whistle or make some kind of signal, lift those up, and push these down the line to the next station. And you see how they start to do a flatbed. And... Yep. So, they're doing all the roofing and trusses over here across the way. Um, the trusses are five and a half inch crown, 16 inch to center, so they're fully serviceable, fully walkable. We do. Um, the wires coming up through there and then the venting yep. from the tank mm -hmm. um, we do batten fiber insulation in between each of the trusses then we do a layer of astrofoil the silvery color astrofoil is similar to what a marathon runner would wear after a big race it deflects all that extra heat and keeps it more consistent underneath so that goes through your cab and throughout the entire rest of the unit and then we have loop decking on top of that and then our pvc liner so PVC isn't new to the industry, but it's new to this use. Um, a lot of other companies are still using PPO, which is a rubber-based yeah. material that's going to absorb heat and eventually contract. Um, PVC, when we started using it, we gave it a 15-year warranty, but it's worked so well that we've done lifetime for that membrane. Plus, it's much easier to do patchwork, go to a hardware store and get PVC cement, as opposed to picking the entire roof with PPO once it's damaged. Interesting. All that loud for being a dump AC unit. No, I don't think they're that loud. Yeah. Excuse me. So this will be a full body paint. That's why the cab is blank. The one in front of us up here. Um, it doesn't have any details on it yet, so it'll be shipped out for full body paint. Oh, okay. yeah, I do like the full body paint. I noticed some over here. So brand new bus coming yep. out, full body, yep. full body full of right. So yeah, they're going to start checking electrical, start putting on the slides around this point, um, bigger pieces of furniture and the TVs and things like that, checking AC units and heating. Um, you, there's usually different color pieces of tape on them. There's about four different quality control checks throughout. So different color pieces of tape indicate where they picked up on that problem and it continues to be a problem over and over then you can go right back to where it starts and talk to that route. Um, we also do a full run with each of our units completely filled up with water um, just to make sure nothing bumps loose. And then we also have our sales guys when they're in the office and not traveling come out and inspect units as they can. Never been to one of these factories before. Yeah. So it's really impressive. Yeah. I always wanted to. It's pretty neat to watch how they flow together. Everybody knows their part and what they're supposed to be doing, and it's pretty neat to see. Oh, I should have got a picture. New designs, layouts come out, and those YouTube people are the ones that are getting it out even faster than we can. You know, um, <laughs> I've watched 
learn so much of yeah. different things. Oh yeah. I like the new front. Yeah. Yeah, I love the big windows too. Yeah, the big windows are really nice. I had someone come through who said she's claustrophobic, and these are the only kind of units she can be in because of those atrium windows open it up so much more. Mm. Nice model here. This one is probably the. Yeah. So this is the dual suite. It's what is it? The dual suite, so two bedrooms, oh. two full baths. This is a new floor plan. Wow. <laughs> two full baths and two yeah. full bedrooms. A nice oh yeah. <laughs> and a loft up there. Yep. Oh, this is the two bedroom suite. Wow, very, very nice. Yeah, we've Gotten a lot of people asking when these will be on dealer lots for them to see. And the bathrooms are always. Yep, brand new floor plan. We just like even the ones that we sold to dealers. A lot of times are already sold to client people, customers. So it's gonna be one one of them. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. Is that full body paint? <laughs> I like that full body paint. Uh huh. And a little lighter with the gold. And I don't use a full body paint. Put some six bad dads. Deviation in this one. This is our oh, okay. new rear kitchen. It usually would not have a desk, so this must be something specially mm -hmm. ordered. Um, it would usually have a couch here. Both of these would be pull outs. And then table. And then a giant bathroom oh, yes. and a giant walk-in closet. Wow. Washer dryer stack. Yeah. So yeah, this is the other new floor plan besides that dual suite. Rear to kitchen. Yep. So we always have any shortages, we make a list. I saw here. She's gonna turn lights on so we can see the cool fleet. Yeah. Little one here being built here. This is a. Mm -hmm. I really like it. That full body base. So yeah, I think this is that front living we were talking about with yeah. that bigger slide out in the bottom. Oh yeah, so this is the dual suite. Yep. Maybe here. Yeah. Two full bathrooms. Well, you sure smell the glue, but boy, I tell you, this is a little lighter, mine. Yeah. Would be the pantry, yeah. Oh, nice big pantry. Yeah, it, nice it does have pantry. quite, a, quite yeah. a bit of pantry space. What I'd miss is like island. We love uh -huh. the island. They did do a trash chute in this one, just trying to eliminate extra space that wouldn't be used. So it has an outside access to take your trash out. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Well, this is nice here. Yeah. Make a little upgrade a lot of times. Wash and dryer, two different sides, yeah. Under storage. A lot of people like that this is, uh, oh, like, is it? Like, stop! 
Well, I wanted to get them to colder, you know. Right, colder faster until they burst. Yeah. <laughs> so these are all new buildings and they started yep. to produce in the 19. Uh, 2000. Produced 2020. Just collected information that whole first oh, year. Oh, okay. The first 15 paradigms. Um, on your way out, you'll see a tan little tiny building. That's where they made them before any of this. Wow. I saw that, yeah. There's a new trailer down there. Avenue plant. Lamination. Lamination. Paradigm plant. All back together, and then we take your couch off inside. And then we fasten it the proper way with the all bracket on the inside. Yeah. That's what they said, is it? Yep. Yeah. Well, here they're putting a new Swintec in on here. These guys and gals here are just awesome. Yeah. Pull the new Swintec in there and out there. Yeah. Cool. Here's a new Valor Alliance travel trailer. Yeah. Sure. I don't want to be anybody's way, but. You can bring your toys along. Yep, exactly. That's pretty nice, yeah. yeah. They're cleaning. <laughs> yeah, they're getting her, getting so ready to go. Oh, bath half bath. bath. Oh, yeah. Good Good. Fold down bed, Room yeah. for your toys, too. Yeah. Before you go, we're back where it started, aren't we? Yeah, we're back oh my gosh! Start. Well, thank you, April. No, yeah, I'm good. It was good. nice to meet you. 